My first competition I went into, I was 13 years old. I didn't get noticed until I was about 24 years old. That's 10 years of work I put in. People want an immediate gain. Uh, they're looking for immediate gains on what they're doing. And so they're not dedicated. You have to persevere. You have to have the mind frame and dedication. That's the reason why so many people fail in what they're trying to do, whether it's business or anything else. They just don't have the dedication. So I put a decade into uh, my work before I even got noticed. And then I had to put five more years into my art before I even got my pro card. That's 15 years before you even heard of Flex Wheeler. So that's how much dedication and perseverance I got to before I even got noticed. Then I put a whole another 10 years on and trying to master my craft as a pro. The minute he walked on stage, it was flipping a switch. Ezekiel and that guy was unreal. To this day, everybody knows who the Sultan of Symmetry is, and everybody knows Flex had the most perfect physique. understood who I am as a bodybuilder. I'm not a wide bodybuilder. I'm not as wide as uh, Ronnie Coleman or Jay Cutler, those guys. I have more narrow clavicles. So I understood what my strength would be is always to, to build a thicker back. I always try to use like a mind-muscle connection, so I always pretty much have my eyes closed when I'm doing this. <laughs> The weight is extreme or not, I still try to get the same mental focus and control on it. My mental mindset is always the same, we're trying to get it ready for it. Yeah. Yeah. 